Hey everyone, it's Jason. Welcome to Digimon Card Game Blast Days. This is part two. Uh, so for some reason you haven't checked out part one, go back, check it out. I go through, um, I think I had 26 packs. Uh, and I go through most of them. I have 13 left, so I went through about half. Usually I don't go through that many, but I was getting a lot of duplicates, so I decided to. Um, so yeah, if you're not familiar with how I do my videos, just a quick wrap through. Um, any cards I went through in the previous video, I will not reread. Um, any new cards will definitely take a second to look at. Um, as well as if we've already completed any of the rarities, I will just go a really quick, even quicker flip through. Um, I may, may not just skip them 100% completely, uh, but I may opt to once I start digging down to the rares, I might just skip right to the rares. Um, so our breakdown of our pack is we have 40 commons, 26 uncommons, 22 rares, 12 super rares, and 3 secret rares. So typically I open up a full box, which is 24 packs. I usually get all commons, all uncommons, most of the rares, and sometimes I'm missing 2 or 3. Um, half of the super rares, so I get 5 or 6, and I usually get 1 secret rare and 1 alt rare. Um, as far as I know, I have not yet gotten alt rare. Um, I have not gotten any secret rares, and for super rares, I only got 3, so I'm way behind on my su super rare limit. Um, I need to get about three or four more to build back up there. Um, for rares, I am at 14 of the 22, so I'm a little over half, so I'm doing pretty well on them. For uncommons, we have 23 of the 26. There's only three uncommons I'm missing. Um, and for commons, I've already shown all 40 of them, so I'll kind of whip through them a little bit quicker. Uh, if I get, again, if I get all the commons, I get the last three, sorry, last three uncommons, I might just skip to the rares in the pack and just try and end these up a little bit quicker. Um, so there's two other things to note about this in case for some reason you didn't check out part one, you just want to see part two, is they did add the new rings around the Digivolve in play symbols for the colors. Um, I'm assuming that's just so if you're having your hand fan, you can see what color your card is a little bit quicker. Um, and the other thing is we have the brand new type. So spoiler for the last pack is we have the new ace type cards, um, which basically lets you do blast evolution. Um, to play this from your hand a lot cheaper or for free on doing other Digimon. Uh, but then they have the ace down here, overflow minus three. So I don't know if it's going to be the same for every single one or if it's just her specific one for Lilymon. It says when this card would move from the battle area or under a card to another area, lose three memory. Um, yeah, so they let you basically play higher level cards a lot quicker um, or a lot cheaper, but they do have a drawback. Um, and those are in these super rare categories. So I think there's only the four different aces in this set. Um, and our different colors as we have red are basically tie from the, from the first series are going to be tie agumon cards we're missing a bunch of cards from them assuming there's more in here um in blue we have joe with his uh Golemon line in green we have mimi and her palmon line in yellow we have tk with his pagamon line so those are the four getting four from the first series so hopefully they'll do another series where we get the other four um then in purple, we have um, cards from Digimon Seekers and the SOC, which we learned in the last video stands for uh, Sons of Chaos, which is kind of like an organization. I don't know if they're directly evil, because it sounds like you probably play as them, but they're at least um, antagonists, I guess, might be the correct word, protagonists. Um, so there's a purple line, and they're going to have the low, low Gromon line. And then we have, in black, we have the Giggy Police and Giggy Brigade. Um, and the Giggy Brigade cards, which I found that was really cool, is I didn't real actually notice they're an Agumon line, uh, which is really neat. Um, and we haven't had any white cards, so we don't know anything about those yet. All right, we're going to go ahead and hop into our first pack. Since we have all the commons, we're just kind of flip through a bunch of these really quickly um, as not to go wrong. So Quagamon, Goblimon, DCD Bomb, Datamon, Vegamon, Marine Debamon, Pummelwack, 
our first uncommon is brand new. We have Bukamon. So now I think we have all the different babies so far. We might be missing one. Watch that tree. I didn't even notice that. They put the little Gigi egg symbol up in there too. That's definitely cool. Uh, your turn when your opponent has no Digimon with more Digivolution cards than this, gains jamming. Awesome. I'm going to put him down here just to keep him separate. We have a Shoga Dekumon. And an Ebimon, which you've seen before. Our first rare is also brand new. We have a Numamon. He has a light on his head. Oh, that's cool. He's part of the Gigi Police. Um, oh, and this is going to be the other... Our other new... Uh, seeker character. So we had the purple and now we have one for the black. By placing Satsuki Tamari from your hand as this Digimon's bottom devolution card, one of your Digimon gains a rush. Cool. So we're still waiting for her Tamer card. Otherwise, we have all the rest. And then we have another super rare right off the bat, but we've already had this, but this is Brigade Ramon. Uh, she's definitely cool. Like I said, I didn't realize these were supposed to be a... Uh, Greymon line, but that's definitely a War Greymon. Um, and we had one that looked like uh, regular Greymon, so I hope we get a Metal Greymon version um, in that lineup, which would be really awesome. Alright. Second pack, Heaven's Knuckle, Poison Ivy, Electmon, uh, Gizamon, Skull Sakamon, Kawagamon, and Numamon. Um, and of course, there's also other lines of characters. We got like the Numamon, Quagamon line. We got um, Ogremon line. We got um, Leomon line. Lots of them, of course, are lots of cards from the Digivolution series or uh, Adventure series. Uh, we have Ghoulmon, Emissary of Hope, and hey, there's our Greymon version. Um, Or is that supposed to be... That's a champion version. Yeah, so that'd be Greymon. Um, as a high command Greymon. Um, definitely cool. Alright, so our first rare... Oh, look at this. Um, so, Cargo, Drum, Cargo Greymon. He's an airship. That's awesome. Um, on play, one Digivolver. Maybe the top three cards in your deck. You may play one card with Beaver Dig or Gigi. Please create... And play a cost of four or less a month without paying its cost. Um, and it has inherent effect. And one of your other Digimon is deleted. Reveal the top three cards of your deck. You may play one Commander Mon one them without paying its cost. Nice. That's cool. Um, then we actually got this. We have Metal Greymon Ace. Um, so it's interesting here. I need to point this out. I did not know what the Lilymon's. Um, Starman, I wonder if this is all artwork. Um, because that one has a star, sorry, has a star down here in the bottom by its, uh, rarity. So I wonder if this is an alt art. But he does have the overflow three as well. Um, but that's cool, because we haven't had Metal Greymon. So I wonder if we're not going to get the alt, or the mega versions. Because I guess most of them don't have mega versions. Um, we'll see. Um... Digivolve level 4 with Greymon's cost. Hand counter Digi Blast Digivolve. One of your Digimon may Digivolve into this card without paying its cost. When on play, when Digivolving, delete one of your points. Digimon 6,000 DPRS. It's actually kind of cool if the Ace cards are going to, at least for the time being, be ultimate level and not mega level. Because then they won't be super overpowered. Um, but that's definitely... I always love the fact that he has wings in everything, but you never see him fly in the original cartoon. I don't recall him flying. Like, he has wings. I remember the toy. I had a, a, a transforming toy, and he, he pull out, you know, he has his purple wings. The old toys had the wings, and he never flew. Um, it was always kind of weird to me. Um, alright, next pack. Oh, look at that. First card, we have a Megadamon. So, I thought we had all the commons. So I had to have miscounted the common. This is why I don't tend to just just skip over them. Um, so I must have missed a common somewhere. Because we did not have him yet. Uh, but yeah, he's cool. Um, when attacking, delete one of your opponents. Gives you 5,000 DP or less. Nice. Alright, so we have Code Wagamon, Mega Flare, Shellmon, Awak, Awak, Aqua. 
Aquagumon. Ooh, I messed that up. Gishumon, Vegamon, I'm just going to keep going. First on common, we have Baumon. Uh, we have a Kangamon. Oh, we did not have this baby yet. Uh, she's a bulb type. Uh, still waiting for a Palmon and a Pal Palmon and a Pagamon yet. Um, once per turn, one of your effects suspends a tamer if his mind is 2,000 DP, DP till the end of turn. Awesome. Uh, Digimon. Our first rare is Goldramon. We've already had him, but he is cool because he creates tokens. And then we had Monzamon. I just love the artwork on there. Um, Alright. Kind of just blasting through these. Let's see what we got. Heaven's Knuckle, Chumon, Kogawagamon, Damerman, Ogremon, Gisomon, Gekomon, our uncommons, we have Ghoulmon, Ebimon, and Missamon, and our rares, we have Saffromon, which we already had, and we finally get a Pagamon, but he's a super rare, wow. Um... Definitely cool. So start your main phase. Um, just one second. I'm kind of sorting these out. Because I had three um, uncommons we were missing. So it's kind of fair if I get them last three, I would know. Uh, start your main phase. Church of Security stack this Digimon may Digivolve into a yellow Digimon card with the vaccine trait among them without paying its cost. Then shuffle your security stack. If the Gigi Evolution by this effect may place one yellow card of the vaccine, create from your hand on the bottom of your security stack. So basically, you can just straight up force Gigi Ball himself up. Nice. Um, Crisis or gain one memory. That's awesome. Also, love the background down there. It has the stained glass windows Pagamon, Angemon, Mad Angemon, and Saffromon. Um, that's awesome. Like, stay I almost wish it Pagamon would move out of the way so I can see that artwork. Because that's really cool. Um, <laughs> definitely neat. Alright, so we'll go ahead and drop that into our super rare. That gives us uh, five super rares. So we're not quite halfway there, but we're doing alright. Uh, Shellmon, Gekomon, Gazamon, Homowak, Wakamon, Megnermon. Uncommons, we have a Triangomon. Another Bukamon and another Baumon. Our rares, Ekamon, and oh, look at that. We got Zudomon Ace. Um, yeah, so that has to be full artwork for Lilimon. That has to be the alt. So I got one alt rare technically, and I'd probably take that away from one of my super rares, but that's all right. So we got another one. We got three of the four different Ace cards, though. Uh, we're just looking for Angemon's lineup. I'll be mad at Angemon, actually, if it keeps the ultimate line. Um, I love Zudomon's look, too. Thor's hammer, he has. Um, on play, one Digivolving Trash, any two Digivolution cards from your opponent's Digimon, then return one of your opponent's Digimon with no Digivolution cards to his hand. So you keep removing cards, and you get some of these are like, boom, now you just return that guy, too. Definitely cool. I also like that he's summoning thunder, but it looks like he's underwater doing it, which seems like a really unsafe idea. <laughs> Alright, next pack. Ogremon. With his pre-evolution of Goblimon. Bangmon. Unimon. Gekomon. Gatsumon. Triceramon. Our uncommon, we have another Ibramon. Misamon. And an Emissary of Hope. Our two rares we have Skull Greymon. Nice. Um, undead type. Um, when going Digimon, by trashing one card in your hand, delete one of your Digimon at the lowest level and one of your opponent's Digimon at the lowest level. On deletion, may play one Agamon from your trash without paying its cost. If you have a Tamer with Kai Kamiya in its name, that Digimon gains rush for this turn. Neat. So this is kind of like showing like his alternate thing where he force, forces him into Skull Greymon. That's really cool. I wonder if, though, if this is going to replace Megal Greymon in this set. 
because uh, we haven't seen Mega Greymon yet. And the other rare, who I did not expect this at all, we have another uh, Tamer, uh, Genai. Um, on play, maybe the top five cards of your deck, add one level three Digimon and one non-white Tamer among them to your hand. Return the rest to the bottom of your deck. Opponent's turn, when opponent's level five or higher Digimon attacks, by suspending this Tamer, move one of your Digimon from the breeding area to the battle area. That's neat. I did not honestly expect um, Genai to be in this set or ever to see him as a card. So that's really cool. Um, I wonder if we'll ever get the young version. That'd be kind of neat as well. Um, that's definitely neat. So that's a cool extra rare we got. Um, so we got two more of the rares. So we're getting closer in our rares. We're at 14. We're at 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 of 22. Um, so yeah, we're getting most of them. So I think we're going to have most of them. And uncommons, we were at... We're missing one uncommon. So we should probably get most of them. Uh, Mega Flare, Kekakorimon, Quagamon, Megaramon, Saber Leomon is an uncommon. Winds of Dark Delusion, Dark Wing Delusion, and Dragon of Courage, which we've seen, definitely a neat one. Our first rare is another Devamon, and our other one... <gasps> that audible gasp is me pulling a secret rare of Angemon. Oh my gosh, I didn't expect Angemon to be a secret rare. Um, that's cool, do I not have an irregular Angemon then? That's awesome. Um, especially because I love Angemon. I love this foil. Got some cool foilage in there. Um, what does he do? Digiball Pagamon cost two. Oh, normally he's a lot cheaper if it's Pagamon. When attacking, by deleting this Digimon, activate one of the fallen effects. Awesome. Like, uh, like a story, you can sacrifice himself. Place one of your opponent's Digimon with the virus trait at the bottom of the security stack. Maybe your points Digimon gets minus 5,000 DP on deletion. Place this card to bomb your security stack. Then if you have a Tamer, you may hatch, hatch it in your breed area. <gasps> nice. Um, on deletion, place one yellow card to vaccine trait from your secure from your hand of the bottom of your deck. That's cool. Um, it's cool because that works really neat with his other two cards: Emissary of Hope and Hand of Fate. That's awesome. So I got alt rare and I got a secret rare. And we're missing we're gonna have all the commons. We have most of the uncommons and most of the rares. So we'll just be missing a couple of super rares, which again is pretty common to happen. Um but that's definitely sweet. Um Alright. Let's move on. Mega Flare, Marching Fishes, Gekomon. We still need a Palmon yet. Pummelwack, and we need some more of the uh, Wolgiamon cards. Wagamon. Oh, our last uncommon, we have the ultimate Marine Angamon. So this is the original supposed alternate, uh, the original ultimate evolution for um, uh, Golmamon. It was supposed to be up through Zugamon, and it was just returning Marine Angamon. Um, but then later I think they changed them into Vikemon because it made more sense that direction. We've also had Plesiamon, who have also made sense as well. Both of them made more sense than this. Um, but it's also kind of funny because you have Marine Devilmon and now you have Marine Angemon. Um, by returning one of your opponent's level 3 Digimon, or one of your Digimon to your hand, return one of your opponent's Digimon's level is less than equal to the Digimon level. Okay, makes sense. Keep returning stuff. Cool. Awesome. So that should be all of our comments and uncommons. So now we're just looking for some rares. Um, Tangamon and Wave of Reliability. Our first rare is a Monzamon. And our second one is a super rare. Uh, Fenril. Uh, Fenri Logamon. Uh, awesome. So it's like. So it's the Lugamon type. But it's also like. Uh, the mythical Norse Fenrir. 
Um, when digivolving, you may place one level 4 lower card with Dark Animal or SSC trait from your hand without paying its cost. If you have EG in, in this Digivolution card, because you have Mind Link, so you can actually go into the Digi, Digimon's thing. It's really cool. Kind of like the uh, Fusion Tamers thing. Or Frontier Tamers thing. Um, add 2 to the number of this effect. Only attacking once per turn. By going to one of your opponents level 3 or lower Digimon, unsuspend this Digimon. For each Digimon, add 1 to the level. Um, your turn. The turn and condition of the opponent having 3 or more memory. Crazy. Um, so that's the Mega version. So we're just wait We just need the Rookie version of this guy yet. Which I'm guessing is also going to be a rare card. Um... Go Quagamon, Vegamon, Gazamon, Quagamon, Marine Devamon, Tengiamon, Heaven's Knuckles, our first uncommon Togamon, Circus, Curse, and another Ghoulmon. Our first rare is another Leomon. Leomons are always fun, and another Monzamon, which should be fine, except I don't need 18 Monzamons. Alright, we are down to four packs. So we're looking for some more rares. All right, Chuchumon, followed by a regular Chumon, Poison Ivy, Gatsumon, Ogremon, Sequimon, Kogawagamon, Koromon. Uncommons. We have another Togomon and a Bloomy of Sincerity. Our first one we have TK Kakashi. Nice. Now we have all four of those Tamers. We're just missing the. Uh, black Tamer. Um, by returning the top card of your security stack to your hand, you may place one yellow card of vaccine trait from your hand at the bottom of your security stack. Um, cool, so you can kind of swap around your security cards. Uh, on your turn, when one card is added to your security stack by suspending this Tamer, gain one memory. Um, So, what's neat here, so just an idea here. So on Galician, place the bottom of, the bottom of your security stack. And if you have a tamer, you may hack in your breeding areas. You can set up another one. So, right after you use Angemon's effect, he goes in his security stack. Then you play this. You keep, if you have him um, on play, return top card of your security stack to your hand. Then you may place one yellow. The vaccine trait from your hand of the bottom of your deck. You can kind of start rotating your deck a bit. Um, so if you have a lower security stack, you might be able to get Angemon out even quicker. It's kind of a neat little idea. Um, and then we have Plesiomon, which I said was the alternate other type of Gomamon one, which makes sense. It's got like the purple stripes and the orange hair. Um, but yeah, then they went. But he kind of doesn't really fit as much with the. The Kakumon or Zugomon line. Um, so very interesting. Alright, four packs to go. Let's see if we can get some more cool cards here. Um, Pummelwack, I love that. Kuagamon, Kunamon, Skullsakamon, Gizamon, Akamamon, Bukamon, and Baumon, and High Commandermon. That's actually, you know, I like getting more of those. Our first rare is another solo Um Oh, neat. I didn't think we were going to get that. We got a new rare. We got Rosemon. Um, I wasn't for sure if we were going to get the mega form of uh, Palamon. Um, that's cool. So we're still missing like all the Agumon cards. But maybe they just didn't put Agumon cards in this set. Um, which would be weird to have Tai and some other cards that involve Warmon and Greymon and stuff, but not actually have them. But then again, they're in so many other sets, so I could definitely see them just being like, nah, we just skipped them in this set because you probably already have them in like the last 10 different sets. Um, anyway, here's Rosemon. When Digivolving and when attacking, suspend one of your opponent's Digimon or Tamers. Your turn, when an effect suspends a Digimon Tamer, you may unsuspend this Digimon. Uh... Cool. So I should basically just keep untapping herself. Um, definitely neat. I would, I like, I know they have it in the Tri-Series. I would have loved, though, to see what Teenage Mimi 
would have thought of Rosemont. Obviously, if I try, they were more like teenagers. I would say, I guess, like kid version of her would have said about this. Oh, uh, because you know, she had Palmon, little veggie creature, they had Togemon, big giant cactus, and she finally got Lilymon, like towards the end of the season, which is a little fairy type. And it's kind of like, oh, that's cool. I would love to see it happen. She could boss and get like Rosemont at some point. Um, that would have been neat. All right. So we have Heaven's Knuckle, Unimon, Fixamon, Dislebum, Logaramon, which don't need your rookie form. Shellmon, Dislebum, Shogun Deckomon, Uncommons, as another Sukumon, and new one, we have Black King Numamon. So apparently I counted my uh, Uncommons wrong too, because now I have four Uncommons. Uh, when I thought I only needed three. That or the numbers on the packs are wrong. Which is also a very good possibility. Um, but Black King, we had another Numamon. We had some Numamons in some of the previous sets too. So they're making a full Numamon theme. Um, on deletion, we the top three cards of your deck. From among them, add one card with Mons and Mons name from your hand. Add one Digimon with Numamon. Instant without paying a cost. Return the rest to, to the bottom of the deck. Cool. All right. Uh, we have another Mimi, and <gasps> that's awesome. We have our fourth ace. We have all four aces. Although now I almost wish I had Lilymon in this version versus the old art. Just so I had all four that went together. Um, but we have Magna and Angemon. So I'm missing like Palmon and. Logramon, and I would have that those two lines up finish. Otherwise, I have almost every other line. Um, obviously, Digiblast on play when Digivolving. If you have five or three security cards, recover a deck one. Then for the then for the turn, one of your opponents is minus gets minus one thousand DP for each card in your security stack. That's definitely cool. Um, and then, yeah, he can hop in there really fast. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, two packs to go. Okay, I just need them last. Those last two rookie cards. I like, thought like I'm hunting down baseball cards. Ah, like, oh, just... You need that Ken, Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. I need that uh, Palmon rookie card. Um, that's awesome. All right. Electmon, Gamiamon, Monochromon, Magnetomon, Ringabamon, Dokugamon. I haven't had too many of him. Gatamon, Kranamon, Bukamon, and Baumon. Our first rare is Platinum Numamon, who's just crazy. <gasps> We got a second alt art. And it's awesome. We got Joe Tito. That's definitely cool. Uh, so I got two alt arts in this pack. And one secret rare. That's nuts. Um, so I think I'm at 20 rare. Of according to the packs at least. 22. So I think I'm missing two rares. And of the super rares. We have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of the 12 super rares. So I am actually doing pretty well on super rares. I'm not obviously going to get all 12 at this point. I only got two more cards. Um, and I won't get all the rares either if I'm missing... Um, if I'm missing uh, three of them. What did I say? I had 14. I have two I'm missing. So unless I get two brand new ones, I'm probably going to be missing some of the rares. Um, but that's not bad. Two rares and like three or four uh, super rares is not terrible. And that's actually a really ultimate card. Uh, Joe with Gomamon. Um, and then the uh, Crest of Reliability. That's cool. Um, so I'm hoping... To get Palmon or Logramon, so I get one of those two lines finished. Or I would love to honestly get the Lilymon Ace card of the regular artwork. Um, I would find that awesome as well. 
All right, Poison Ivy, Unimon, Vegamon, Shellmon, Chumon, Gatsumon, Little Girlmon, Tangamon, Wave of Reliability, and Coromon. All right, our rares. Last two rare cards. Gold Roman. Oh, okay. I already have like three of him. And Egamon, which I already had a couple of him. All right. Unfortunately, no new ones. Um, that is what we have, though. Um, for Digimon Blast Ace. Um, I'm not going to do a full follow-up review of how many I ended up with. I pretty much am pretty much close. I'm missing... Um, Obviously, two of the secret rares. I don't know which ones they are for this set. I, I can go look it up on the computer. Um, but I don't really feel like doing that for this video. Um, all right, that's what we got for this. See you guys later. Hope you enjoyed the video. Check out some more. Bye.